The ocean is home to some of the largest animals on Earth, whales. These magnificent creatures, particularly the blue whale, dwarf even the most massive land animals, blue whales reaching lengths of over 100 feet and weighing over 200 tons are a testament to the remarkable evolutionary journey of life in the ocean. How did these gentle giants come to be so large? The answer lies in a fascinating interplay of biological adaptations, environmental factors and evolutionary history. From the physics of buoyancy to the efficiency of their respiratory and circulatory systems, whales have evolved a suite of features that allow them to thrive at a colossal scale. Understanding these factors is key to appreciating the grandeur of whales and the delicate balance they maintain in the marine ecosystem. Their immense size is not just a spectacle, it's a testament to the power of natural selection and the intricate web of life in our oceans. In the following sections, we'll delve into the science behind why whales are ocean giants, exploring the fascinating adaptations that allow them to rule the deep. One of the most significant factors contributing to the enormous size of whales is the buoyancy provided by water. Unlike land animals that constantly battle gravity, marine creatures experience an upward force that counteracts their weight. This buoyant force allows whales to grow to sizes that would be impossible on land, where gravity would put immense stress on their bones and organs. Water's density is much higher than air, offering significantly greater support. This means that whales don't need massive skeletal structures to support their weight. Their bones are surprisingly lightweight compared to land mammals of similar size. This reduced skeletal mass allows for greater flexibility and maneuverability in the water, further contributing to their success as aquatic giants. The buoyancy of water has played a crucial role in the evolution of gigantism in whales. Freed from the constraints of gravity, these marine mammals were able to evolve larger and larger body sizes taking advantage of the abundant food resources available in the vast expanse of the ocean. Another crucial aspect of whale gigantism is thermoregulation, the ability to maintain a stable body temperature. Whales are warm-blooded mammals and they inhabit a vast range of ocean temperatures, from the tropics to the frigid polar regions. Their large size plays a critical role in helping them conserve heat. A basic principle of physics dictates that larger objects have a smaller surface area to volume ratio. This means that whales, with their enormous bulk, lose heat to the surrounding water much slower than smaller animals. This efficient heat conservation is particularly crucial in colder waters, allowing whales to maintain their body temperature with minimal energy expenditure. Furthermore, many whale species have a thick layer of blubber, a specialized type of fat that acts as insulation, trapping heat within their bodies. This blubber layer, combined with their large size and low surface area to volume ratio, makes whales incredibly efficient at conserving heat, allowing them to thrive in even the coldest ocean environments. To sustain their massive size, whales require highly efficient respiratory and circulatory systems. Whales are air-breathing mammals and they have evolved remarkable adaptations to accommodate their underwater lifestyle. Their lungs are proportionally smaller than those of land mammals but they are incredibly efficient at extracting oxygen from the air. During a surface breath, whales can exchange up to 90% of the air in their lungs compared to humans who only exchange about 15%. This highly efficient gas exchange, combined with their ability to hold their breath for extended periods, allows whales to dive deep and for long durations in search of food. Whales also possess a remarkable circulatory system that can handle the demands of their massive size. Their hearts are enormous, with the blue whale's heart being the size of a small car. This powerful pump circulates blood efficiently throughout their vast bodies, delivering oxygen and nutrients to their tissues and removing waste products. In this chapter, we will explore the feeding habits of whales, focusing on how their massive size influences their diet and hunting strategies. Whales have evolved various feeding mechanisms from filter feeding baleen whales to the deep diving sperm whales. Understanding these feeding strategies provides insight into the ecological roles whales play in the ocean. Baleen whales, such as the humpback and blue whales, possess baleen plates instead of teeth. These plates act as a sieve, allowing them to filter vast amounts of small prey like krill and plankton from the water. 
During a feeding event, a baleen whale can engulf up to 500 gallons of water in a single gulp, using its tongue to push the water out while trapping the food in its baleen. On the other hand, toothed whales like orcas and sperm whales demonstrate remarkable hunting techniques. Orcas, also known as killer whales, are apex predators that hunt in coordinated pods using sophisticated strategies to capture prey ranging from fish to seals. Sperm whales dive to incredible depths, sometimes over 3,000 feet, to hunt giant squid in the dark abyss. These feeding habits not only sustain the whales, but also have a profound impact on marine ecosystems. By consuming large quantities of prey, whales help regulate species populations, maintaining the balance within the ocean's food web. Moreover, their nutrient-rich waste products, often referred to as whale falls, provide essential nutrients that support marine life at all levels. From the surface to the deep sea, whales' feeding habits showcase their adaptability and the vital roles they play in the health and stability of ocean ecosystems. In this chapter, we will delve into the social behaviours of whales. Whales are known for their complex social structures and communication methods, from the haunting songs of humpback whales to the intricate social bonds of orcas. These behaviours contribute to their survival. Humpback whales are famous for their elaborate songs, which can last for hours and travel vast distances. These songs play a role in mating rituals, allowing males to attract mates and establish territories. Each population has its own unique song, which can change and evolve over time. Orcas, or killer whales, exhibit some of the most sophisticated social structures in the animal kingdom. They live in tight-knit family groups known as pods, which can consist of up to 40 individuals. These pods are matriarchal, with the oldest female leading the group. Orcas communicate using clicks, whistles and pulsed calls, with each pod having its own distinct dialect. These social bonds and communication methods are crucial for their survival. Orcas use coordinated hunting strategies, working together to corral fish or hunt larger prey like seals. This teamwork is possible because of their strong social bonds and sophisticated communication. Moreover, the social behaviours of whales extend beyond their own species. There have been numerous accounts of whales interacting with other marine animals and even humans. These interactions highlight the intelligence and curiosity of these gentle giants. Understanding the social lives of whales deepens our appreciation for these creatures and underscores the importance of preserving their habitats. Studying whales provides valuable insights into the complexities of ocean life and the delicate balance that sustains it. In the concluding chapter, we will discuss the conservation efforts aimed at protecting these ocean giants. Whales face numerous threats, including climate change, pollution and hunting. Climate change is altering the seas, affecting the availability of their prey and changing their migration patterns. Pollution, particularly plastic waste and chemical contaminants, poses a serious threat to their health. And despite international bans, illegal hunting and bycatch continue to endanger whale populations. However, there is hope. Around the world, dedicated individuals and organizations are working tirelessly to ensure the survival of these magnificent creatures. Marine protected areas are being established to provide safe havens for whales, free from human interference. Stricter regulations on shipping routes and fishing practices are being implemented to reduce the risk of collisions and entanglements. Innovative technologies are being developed to monitor and protect whale populations. Drones and satellite tracking help researchers gather crucial data on whale movements and behaviors, enabling more effective conservation strategies. Public awareness campaigns and education programs are also playing a vital role, encouraging people to take action and make more sustainable choices. From the icy waters of the Arctic to the warm tropical seas, these efforts are making a difference. By working together, we can ensure that future generations will still have the chance to marvel at these gentle giants of the deep. Understanding and protecting whales is not just about saving a species, it's about preserving the health of our oceans and the intricate web of life they support. As we continue to strive for a balance between human activity and marine conservation, we remember that every effort counts and every action matters. Join us in the fight to protect these incredible beings and their ocean home. Together, we can make a difference.